Now, let us see one interesting question from the real numbers that is based on Euclid's division algorithm. The question is, you express the HCF of 210 and 55 as 210 into x plus 55y, where x and y are integers in two different ways. Here, finding HCF of given numbers is not at all a matter. By using the division method, and Euclid division algorithm, you can easily find HCF. Whereas, writing that HCF in terms of given two numbers is somewhat some interesting task. Let us see how do we do this problem. That too, you are asked to express the HCF in terms of given two numbers in two different ways. This is important. Let us see. Given numbers. Two ten and fifty five. We have to find HCF. Step one. HCF of two ten and fifty five by Euclid's division algorithm. Two ten can be expressed as when you apply Euclid division algorithm for these two, two ten can be expressed as fifty five into three plus forty five. See to understand better, let us do successive division method that is uh, continuous division method. There from that uh, pattern you can easily write. Uh, these statements 210 divided by 55 3 times 165 difference 45 as the difference is not 0 we have to continue the division by taking remainder as divisor that uh, previous divisor as divided again 45 1 times difference is 10 Again, continue the division. 4 times 40. Again, continue the division. 2 times 10. Finally, got the remainder 0. You cannot further proceed uh, for division because division with 0 is not defined. This divisor is the HCF. So, this is HCF of given two numbers. How do we write the statements? See, again, apply the division algorithm for uh, these two, that is 55 can be expressed as 45 1 times into 1 plus remainder 10. Again, for these two, 45 can be written as 10 into 4 plus 5. Again, for these two, 10 can be written as 5 into to remainder 0. As the remainder is 0, HCF of given two numbers 210 and 55 is equal to 5. This divisor is the HCF. Yes, very easy. You can easily find the HCF. Then, your task is now to express this 5 in terms of 210 and 55. For this you have to make use of uh, these remainder structures. So, one by one, let us see how do we write. This is the uh, second part of the problem. I think you may have understood. Let me erase this portion. Yes, 5. How we can write 5 in terms of uh, 210 and 55? Let us see. Where is 5 as remainder? Yes, we have to start from here. So 5 can be expressed as 45 minus 10 into 4. So 45 minus 10 into 4. Now you have to eliminate this 45 and 10. 45 again, 
where is 45 as remainder? Yes, 45. So this 45 can be replaced by 210 minus 55 into 3. So instead of 45, from this equation, I am writing as 210 minus of 55 3 times. This is instead of 45 only, minus 10. Where is 10 as remainder? Yes, here. So, this 10 can be replaced by 55 minus 45 1 times. So, 55 minus 45 1 time. Use the bracket here. This is only instead of 10. Again, this should be taken 4 times. So, here you need to apply the distribution. 10 minus 55 3 times minus apply the distribution 55 4 times minus 45 into 1 into 4 that is 45 4 times remove that brackets 210 minus 55 3 times minus 55 4 times minus cp minus plus 45 4 times almost we have done 210 55 55 yes you have to eliminate the 45 again 45 see the 45 remainder in this equation so 45 in terms of 4 210 and 55 210 minus 55 3 times so let us again replace there 210 minus 55 3 times minus 55 4 times plus instead of 45 210 minus 55 into 3 into 4 plus distribution so 210 minus 55 into 3 minus 55 into 4 plus 210 4 times minus 55 into 4 threes to 1 so almost 98 percent is done all the product are, products are in terms of 210 and 55 210 totally how many times here one time here 4 times, totally 5 times, take uh, minus 55 common, here 3 times, plus here 4 times, plus here 12 times, so this can be written as 210 into 5, minus 55 into 19, 16 plus 3, 19. So, if you write this product as plus, then you have to apply this minus to the multiplier. That is 210 taken 5 times plus 55 taken minus 19 times. Look at this. Plus into minus minus, 55 into 19. Then, finally, Therefore, 5 can be expressed as, this is CF, can be expressed in terms of 210 and 55 as 210, 5 times, plus 55 into minus 19. So, this is one way of expressing the given HCF in terms of 210 and 55. This is 1. But you are asked to express it two different ways. Then what would be the second? Let me use this space. Third step. What we have arrived here? 5 is equal to 210 5 times plus 55 minus 19 times. Let me add 210 55 times 
minus 55 two ten times both products are same plus minus gets cancelled why I have taken you can easily understand to get the other form so two ten five and fifty five totally how many times sixty times plus fifty five is taken how many times minus ninety plus minus two ten So, 210 into 60 plus 55 into minus 19 minus 210 minus 219. So, 5 can be expressed as 210 into 60 plus 55 into minus 219. This is the second one. So, this, so it is in the form of 5 is in the form of 210 into x plus 55 into y where x is equal to 60 and y is equal to minus 219 that is one form and from 1 5 can be expressed as 210 into x plus 55 into y where x is equal to 5 and y is equal to minus 19. So this is how we can express uh, the HCF of given two numbers in two ways. Thank you. I hope you understand.